Hi everybody, it's Sally with Vintage Discoveries with some vintage jewelry haul. Oh man. This is um, upsetting. Do you remember this? I was all excited about this big hunk of glass and then I think I dropped it maybe the next day. See, it's chipped. You can't see it from the front, but I sure did. I sure did do that. Still beautiful. But yeah, look at that. Leave it to me. Woo! Got these peppermint patties from Japan. A little dirty, but this is um, just gold electroplated. It's not bad. This is pretty, I like the canateal and some aurora borealis. I don't remember what this says. It is. Western Germany. I think it's silver. Pretty. Oh, this. Whew. That's a lot of Aurora Borealis there. Ooh, look at that one. Really pretty. Not marked, but does matter. Does not matter. Why is there flakes? That's not from the necklace. That's just something flaky. I don't know what it is. It's really pretty. It's got a lot of gold in it. You know, like gold hues. Sometimes the Aurora Borealis will have the blue more and I prefer the blue, the pink sometimes. Did anybody get this other earring in their box or something? Because I could swear I have another one. Oh boy. Oh, and I found another one of these. Someone had asked me for the other one that I had but it wasn't working. This one, we'll have to see if this works. I love this. And I just am so puzzled as to why there is no writing on it. It's like, no, right? It doesn't say Swiss, it doesn't say quartz, it doesn't say anything. Not one thing. Not gold filled, not anything. Unless I'm missing it, because that has happened. This just doesn't look like it belongs. It's like big, but it's so pretty. Somebody's gotta do something with that. Ooh, a little drinky. 80s, 90s, I think that's what it reminds me of. I like this bracelet with the safety, articulated, oh my hands are dry, I don't think it has anything on it, no, no, no maker, but really pretty and flowy, I like it. Goldstone, one of my favorites. Little, uh, I think it's imitation. I don't know, it might be a real one because it's, it's just not good quality. That's cute. Interesting bird brooch. 
very lightweight plastic painted a little rhinestone in there this is pretty I don't know why it has that on the back but it's pretty it's got the little um, CZs and the pearls I believe are faux oh it's like that's an interesting uh, Nope, it's just a circle pin with a pearl. Classic. This is, I believe, sterling. It's weird. It's got this little heart with a lowercase t. 925 by the clasp. And then just this little disc. Maybe somebody intended on getting it, like, engraved or something? I don't know. Let's see if we have this other one. Not seeing it right off the bat. Oops. It's kind of the Japan, West Germany look to it. This is got nothing on it. Oh, I have a, what could I have, what could I have? But it has numbers on it that confuse me. I guess they're different numbers for different countries or something. Uh, I've never had one like this before. So I don't know. I guess this is a nine. That's U.S. And the other ones, I guess I could figure out if I thought about it long enough. So nine and a half, kind of like a champagne, champagne color stone glass. Yeah, I was gonna say Morganite, but that's like a pink, right? And I think this is just glass. But it's pretty. These magnetic, I'm assuming they're earrings or something. Those are kind of yucky, so I'm going to put them to the side. Oh, poor bear. It's being strangled by that. This is pretty. Little gold poops with the black plastic beads. A wooden bear from Williamsburg. Right? Williamsburg. Cool. It looks old to me. Amber. Pretty. I guess Amber had a February birthday. Shoe clip. Missing a stone. I had a couple of these. Oh, somebody told me how to say it and I forgot. Berger. Let's go with that. Another color, and I don't remember what color it was. This is cool. I believe it's a choker. Yeah, by the size of it. Definitely looks like it was meant to be on there, but look. Maybe somebody, because that's like glued or welded. I can see a little glue residue. Perhaps it's we it's it's weird, but cool. It's got some wear. This is I think Geneva. If I can't see it. Yes, pretty little watch. And um. 
really pretty band too. Stretch. Daisy oh, with a ladybug, a little bit beat up, and it's Weiss. Weiss is a good name. Oh my goodness, look at these. I'm going to have to back up for these. Back it up a little bit. These are actually the longest earrings I think I've ever had. Had. They are super duper dangly long. What do they call them like shoulder dusters? Is that what they call them? Whoa. And this groovy one. I guess it's missing. Uh, I don't know if it has a ball every other string. Yeah, it might. I thought it was just missing some of its balls, but it is missing two balls. I didn't see any stray balls around. All silver chain. Let's see if it's sterling. No, oh, but it's an old clasp. Nope. Yeah, I guess you can kind of see how it's worn. Another chain. Let's see if it's got any markings. Nope. It's one of those flat S chains. I'm going to say S because I, I see an S. I don't even know if that's the real name of it. This interesting chunky one reminds me of the ramen packages like you know the ramen soup it's got some wear no I'm not hungry not I had a kale salad I'm kind of late Gave me a stomach ache. Sweater clip. It was open school night, you know. Kind of meet the teachers type thing. So, got home late. Oh, yeah, I remember this. This thing is heavy. Really pretty. It's going in crafts though, because it's broken in the back. Uh, oh, oh, look at this, it fell. It was ugly anyway in there, but <laughs> I think even if you replaced it with a different color, I still don't think it's the nicest pin I've ever seen, but you know, it could be worse. Deplaws. You know, I don't know how to say it. Dupla, Duplaws. Dupla. I guess it would if you, like, you shined it up a bit and maybe put something more interesting. If you were creative or art talented or I don't know what word to use, but, like, painted something on there. People do it. People get real creative. I was thinking as I was uh, at the teacher thing, there seemed to be a lot of teachers with these little delicate bracelets on, little beads. I don't know if it's a thing, little beads and dangly thing, like very, you know, petite. Like I can make that, I can do those. But I try to stop myself from thinking that because then I'll be I'll be ordering all kinds of craft supplies and just I don't I don't I don't need to be doing that. I already have a bunch of beads. 
It's very relaxing beading. If not, you know, I don't know if anybody's into that, but it can be very relaxing. I don't know. This was very pretty um, when it wasn't all beat up, but somebody can maybe repair it. This. These feel like glass, and those are not really heavy, but these are glass. This is a decent looking chain. Not bad. One of these magnetic things. I guess it's a bracelet. I think those are real freshwater pearls. This can go into crafts. Cute little hoops. I find um, when my hands are cold, it's like they can't they can't move right. Really? These look gold to me, don't they? They're cruddy though. They need to be washed. Maybe if I clean them off over there, maybe I'll see some, but I don't think so. But they're not bad hoops, they're cute. Worth giving a clean. Too bad that pearl is all beat up. These are a nice big cufflink. Some stones. They kind of look like almost like beach glass. Oh. Earrings. They're weird. Double dangle. A little pins, cute missing stone now. These are nice red enamel. That's too loosey goosey, but then again, mm, no, even if you tighten that, it's a little too loose. That's a shame. I know there's a tool out there. I don't own it. Does this say something or has it just got like wrinkles or texture? Oh, it's just like a texture. I don't know if it's yeah, I guess there was nothing there. That's just the style of it. A cross uh, ring. Shamrocks and some plastic beads. That won't let go. There we go. It's just some plastic beads tied together sloppily. Oh my goodness. All because of the snowflake. Come on. belongs and what doesn't belong on this. I guess it's just hooked to the snowflake. And this piece of earring. Come on. There we go. Eek. Piece of leather. Don't know what the heck that is. Is this a broken chain or... Well, it doesn't have a little ring on the other side, but that's easy for somebody to fix, I assume. 
little bracelet. Oh, cute. Oh, is this the other? Nope, that's a totally different earring. See, this is a nice back, you know, a little bit wider. Sometimes they're sterling. And sometimes they're not. Um, do you think this was an earring? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it was part of a necklace or something to hang your glasses on. I don't know. Either way, it's going in the craft. Circles. Is that the matching hoop? No, well, it's the matching hoop to that one. That should always be in a wardrobe. Hoops, plain old hoops like that. Like this. It could be like the everyday kind of thing, you know? This looks like little hearts and shamrocks. I don't think I ever wore anything like that. Big 1980s I'm going to go with. Looks like it's got a little bit of like the damage on the other side. Or it's just dirty. No, you can tell it's like probably foiled and it's missing some of that. It's not that bad though. It's like a purpley magenta. Maybe it's older than 80s. Why am I just, um, like making that noise? I think I had two of these. Nice and springy. E Not my type of ring. Just needs a little bit of a little bit more bling. One of those other earrings. Little stud. Cool blue. Turtle bowler. I guess that would be for somebody who is a slow bowler, perhaps. It's got a lot of wear on it. Some plastic. That one, I don't think that one's supposed to look so dull. It's just dirty or something. Leaves. Missing a stone. It's kind of dirty. Cute though. Ooh, that's heavy. Big palm tree with an earring and and a bracelet stuck to it. There we go. It's in nice shape. And it's heavy. Some clip-on. What? Those look weird. Hmm. Very worn. One of the um, old glove clip things. Sarah Coventry, very worn. Oh. This is part of a necklace. Is this the same chain? No. 
It's a bigger link. These have all their stones. So those aren't bad. Oh, here's the other one of those. Piece of acrylic. Might have been a pendant. Oh god, what did I just do? Friendship through bowling. Hmm. Another leaf. Leaves. That's cool. Plain, but cool. Cute little heart. Hearts. That's very worn. Cute little ring. Looks like Avon, but it is. Oh, it's got a lot of wear. Very weak. A big pearl. Um, you know, those things. That was so good. I remembered the name and I, you know. Let's see. It says. Can you see that? Because I can't. Fritinelli? Something Nelly with an Ellie. Piccadilly. Ferdinand Lee. Don't know. I'll have to get my close-up looker thing. Cufflink. Yeah, that was it. Cufflink. That's got a lot of wear. Cufflink. I don't know why I forget about a cufflink. I should write down all those key things that I can never remember. Another bowling ball with a turkey. And I guess that's three strikes. Is that, do they call it a turkey when you have three strikes or something like that? I know this, Sarah Coventry. I don't know the bowling lingo. This is a glass ring. They used to sell these at Pier 1. I don't know why, but they did. Um, looks like a bear. Yeah. I don't know the, the bowling thing, lingo. This is broken. Nice cross and texture. Cuff link. What's the other one? I mean, I've bowled before. I don't know. Sometimes, uh, I don't know if I have the patience for bowling or um, putt-putt golf. I don't know. Am I bad at waiting my turn? Is that it? I would hate to think that. Nothing is impossible for you. All right. If you say so. Oh. Shoot. Well, that's a bold statement. Here is a earring from Trafari. And I wonder if I got the other. I guess we'll just have to put it to the side and see. Have one of these little bears, if that's what that is. It's cute. One of these, like a um, Chinese symbol earring. That's very worn. This would be good for crafting if you like hearts. 
They feel heavy, so I would say they are glass. This is a nice screw back. Triple A. Patrol service? What does that mean? I'm gonna keep all the pins together. Nilsonic. Cool. I see Armatron, the ones, I think they used to have a lot of digital ones like that. They came out with a bunch of new ones. They're pretty neat. Single earring. Oh, the other Sarah. <laughs> this is a pretty leaf. It's got a lot of wear though. It's Jerry's. <coughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, here's the other one. So, that one on the top was definitely discolored. Oh, a little spinny. Little enamel America flag, that's cute. Oh, gee whiz. Little fan, cute. I think this is the kind you can't, you gotta kinda mess with it to make the picture of the, the cranes. Ooh, this has got a really pretty clasp that's broken, but it also has the green stuff, which I don't like to keep around. Shell. Little earring, okay. It's missing all its, almost all of its stuff in there. Big snaky necklace. I like that. It's thick. Glass beads, there's quite a few. Could be glass, could be onyx, I don't know, but it's definitely not plastic. Oh, it's cute. That's glass. Oh, buckle. earring. A uh, bowling angel. That's definitely worn. I don't even know if it's got any color in it. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. Somebody could pop it out and use it if they, if they wanted. I don't like these chains. They just, they have to be really thick and in good shape for me to really like them. Look at that. Boop. Pearl. Stones. That's like a lapel pin, and I don't know if that's glue on there or something, but it's pretty. It's very pretty. Um, no. Just like scraps of stuff. Another one of those weird earrings. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. 925. Like a little lantern with a purple stone. Cute. Looks like 
happen. Like the crescent moon, but it's missing that little stone or something. Near these chains again. The eerie this is pretty. It's Monet. It's pretty. I like that. I think this belongs to that watch, maybe. Is that the same kind of? Yeah, it could be. Um, same kind of, what word am I looking for? Yuck. It is like, not gold. It's all green. Cute though. Um, not brutalist. What am I trying to say? That word, you know that word I'm talking about. Nugget. Nugget. It's a cute name for like a little dog. Nugget. Oh, I'm already at 36 minutes. Ooh. This is cute. You know how I love buckles. I love anything buckly. I don't know why that's discolored. I guess the silver's coming off. It's not um, it's not sterling or anything, but it's cute, right? I like it. This is a whole crap crap load. A whole ton of bracelets. It's a turtle. It's the turtle. Him cute. A little purple stone. Love those little 60s or 70s looking things. I think Carla gave me this in a bunch of stuff. Stainless by Princess. It's neat, right? It's kind of like a spiral graph, kind of like a something. I don't know. I remember I looked up the name. I couldn't find anything about it. Very interesting. This is pretty. It's missing its uh, safety, though. This is damascened with some... I don't think it's Mother Pearl, it's kind of moon glow, but, and this is, I believe from Spain, and it's got the, the hat, and I think, I mean, it's got the safety on it, so I think it had other charms on it that it doesn't have anymore, sadly, because it is really cool. I love this, look how thick that is. It doesn't have anything on it, as far as uh, a name, but I think it was something just a very common kind of bracelet type, just like that other purple one I just showed, but this is not very flexible and it's thick, but it's small. It's got like the cat's eye moon glow. Love it. I wish it was bigger because I can't, I can't. I'll scratch myself up. Ooh. Hey. I think it says Monet. It says Monet. Yeah, and it's L. It's, it's a large one. Yep. So pretty. This, I think it's turtles. Now, all this stuff I've had for a long time. I'm just going through it so I can sort it and sell it and make room and get organized. I think it's a fish. Okay. It's a fish from Mexico. This is Trafari. Very thin. 
dolphin clamper. Orange moon glow bracelet needs a little cleaning. These are very clunky, clunky sounding. Swirly. Oh, here's another um, cloisonne someone was asking about. This is pretty. Really pretty glass green stones. Beautiful color. Kind of like an 80s, 90s, floral, chunky bangle. This I like. The, um, like transfer wear with the flowers. That's so cute. And I have two of these. Silver and gold. Clamp, clamp. I like these. It's a simple design, but I like it. It looks cool, right? Modern yet retro. What do you think? They're comfortable. Thumbs up. Everybody should have one in their wardrobe. A clamper and hoop earrings. All right, guys, we're at 41 minutes and I'm not gonna open another bag because I have to go to bed. And I will load this up or download it upload it whatever it is tomorrow so that you can see it and if you have any questions just email me vintage.discoveries21 at gmail.com same thing you want uh, let me know and i'll be making more craft and wearable lots as soon as i go through the rest of these uh bags and have them up for sale now that i have another one of these then I know my ring size and then I can sell the rings um, so that's great thanks everybody for watching subscribing liking and commenting I appreciate it and I will see you soon thanks bye